For most of history, people discovered new medicines through trial and error, a very inefficient process. That changed when George Hitchings and Gertrude Ellian developed a rational method of drug design, which led to countless new and effective treatments. The two American scientists were born in the early 1900s. Both were extremely bright students who lost a loved one to illness. Their grief drove them to pursue careers in medicine, and their intelligence allowed them to achieve a great deal. Initially, however, Elian suffered through several unfulfilling jobs thanks to the Great Depression and rampant sexism. That changed in 1944, when Hitchings hired Elian to help him develop a new method of drug design. The two scientists found that by focusing on the biological differences between human cells and pathogens, they could create chemicals that would attack the pathogenic cells without harming the healthy human cells. Using that method, Hitchings and Elian successfully developed drugs for leukemia, gout, malaria, meningitis, and viral herpes, to name a few. Researchers around the world quickly caught on, and within a few years, scientists had created medicines to fight the viruses that cause cold sores, chickenpox, and shingles. Eventually, they developed azithromycin, AZT, the first treatment for HIV AIDS. Elian later wrote, "When we began to see the results of our efforts in the form of new drugs which filled real medical needs and benefited patients in very visible ways, our feeling of reward was immeasurable." Hitchings and Elian's work has been used to create treatments for an array of life-threatening illnesses and has saved millions of lives, a number that will only increase as more medicines emerge. For that reason, George Hitchings and Gertrude Ellian are our 33rd Heroes of Progress.